there's there's this sense of almost despair that I think a lot of people on the left have because their party is is failing them, right? Their, their party is essentially trying to make it so hard to live. You know, I know that you don't have a lot to do with taxes, but taxes are being raised. Um, it's getting harder and harder to live. Crime is is through the roof. And Democrats really have been in control for a long time. I know that you said that Rob McKenna was attorney general for for a little bit, but probably before that, it was a lot of a lot of Democrats and a lot of people who have this like utopia of progression. And I think the question that a lot of liberals, especially in Washington state, have to have to ask themselves is what are they progressing to? Because it seems like what they're progressing to isn't conducive for you. It might be conducive for them, right? At the top of their ivory tower, getting all these backroom deals and, you know, really not working for, for all this money. And they're, they're charging you to destroy their own state in the form of taxes. So I guess my encouragement to a lot of people on the left would be to really think like, don't, don't just see the R next to someone's name and just assume a lot of things because my assumption is that Democrats are destroying. It's not Republicans that are destroying the state. It's Democrats. And so I think I think the, the, the way to really, really save Washington is to have a have a like not not necessarily mass awakening, like everyone's going to go be a, a Trumper, but have a mass awakening saying what we're doing right now is not working right the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and over again and expecting different results. 